Tennesseans will soon get a chance to weigh in on a dramatic health care proposal from Governor Bill Lee's administration. The first draft of a plan affecting potentially 1.4 million enrollee, enrollees in the state's Medicaid program, TenCare, it was actually released today. Local 24 News reporter Chris Bungard reports from our exclusive state capitol newsroom. State lawmakers earlier this year passed a bill requiring Governor Bill Lee to seek what's called the 10 care block grant. After a ribbon cutting in Nashville Tuesday, Governor Bill Lee spoke about the first draft just released of getting billions for the state's Medicaid program 10 care in one lump sum yearly from the federal government instead of a nearly two to one match system that every other state uses. The coverage of 1.4 million Tennesseans is at stake, along with potential savings for the state budget. They could be uh, a small amount or a significant amount. And once we determine what that amount is, then we'll decide, well, well then that will help us set policy going forward. Three mid-afternoon times in three parts of the state have been put aside for public input beginning October 1st. We believe we put together a really good proposal that's going to be a win for Tennessee and, and a win for the country if, if we get an opportunity to lead on this. A group advocating for 10 care enrollees doesn't see it that way for the first of its kind proposal. So what it means for the 1.4 million Tennesseans that are on 10 care is that um, we're going to have less funds to, to basically have have their care vital health care needs met. Michelle Johnson will be one of the voices heard at those October public hearings. If it really is that great of a deal, I just wonder why is it that no other governor's lining up to take all this money? No doubt there will be a lot of discussion and debate about the 10 care block grant bill before the final draft is submitted to the federal government on November 20th. Reporting from the state capitol, Chris Bungard.